take a look at the coast of Florida this morning. The uh, west coast, the Gulf side, definitely bracing for some storms. Waking up to tornado warnings this morning in the Tampa Bay area. Here's a look at Clearwater Beach. You can see plenty of white water there. And this is the Gulf of Mexico. Keep in mind, this is typically a very calm body of water. So when you start to see white caps, you know it's on. This is on the east coast over in Melbourne, Florida, basically centrally located there. We'll take you back over to the Gulf region. This is the Island House Hotel in Orange Beach, Alabama. Again, look at the activity there in the ocean. Generally, a very calm Gulf of Mexico. Getting stirred up this morning by Tropical Storm Andrea, the very first storm of our 2013 Atlantic hurricane season. And we do see it coming on shore. It's actually still located. The area of low pressure itself is still located uh, off into the Gulf. It's expected to make landfall about 5, 5.30 tonight, right around the Pensacola area. Once that happens, it's going to continue in a northeasterly direction, which is going to bring it right over southeastern Georgia and, yes, the entire state of South Carolina. So we are looking at some rain today, copious amounts of rain beginning tonight and tomorrow. So get ready. We do have a flood watch in effect from 8 a.m. this morning until 8 p.m. tomorrow night. Three to four inches expected, meaning we could definitely see some flooding in low-lying areas. I need you to get ready and take precautionary measures in areas like Five Points or around the Congaree area. Uh, flood warnings, tornado warnings in effect all over the northern and central parts of Florida, southeastern Georgia, and the coast of South Carolina as we wait for Andrea to make its way up the uh, Gulf region here. Quick look at our uh, storm path brings it on shore about 5.30 tonight. We're expecting it to sweep across the Midlands by 2 a.m. in the morning. So it's going to be the overnight hours where we're going to see the most activity today in the northeastern section of town. We'll see some rain. By tomorrow, it's going to be a more southeasterly storm pattern.